My name is Denny Hunsey. I'm the general manager of Catalina Island Vacation Rental. I've been here on Catalina Island doing this job for about 12 years. And uh, I'd like to speak to you today about a couple of experiences that I've had dealing with the difficult guest. I'm sure we all have our own stories. Well, we had a situation where an elevator for one of our complexes broke down had to be serviced and they could not get it fixed before the busy Memorial Day weekend. Uh, we came up with a solution. Again, you identify the problem. Um, it's a bad elevator. You take the first step of communicating with the guests as best you can and we did that so that all the guests knew coming in and if some of them absolutely couldn't use steps that amounted to, it was about a hundred steps that they had to take, um, we would find alternate accommodations for them. And lastly, if they did still want to use the property, they did want to use the condo, but they needed some assistance with luggage, we enlisted the services of a local company who does that for a living. They will provide uh, a service that brings luggage from the boat landing to a property and bring it back to the boat landing and store it for a fee. And in this case, they delivered it up the steps all the way to the front door of these properties so that the homeowner got their rental, the guest was happy, even though they had some steps, they didn't have to lug their luggage, and the uh, company in town that we work with was very happy to provide the service. One situation that came up very recently, it happened to be of all times on the island of Romance, it was Valentine's weekend when we were completely full out at Hamilton Cove. And wouldn't you know it, the sewer lines went down, could not be fixed, and we had to relocate people. Property. Out of our 50 properties that had to be moved, 48 of these guests and families were tremendously cooperative. Of course, I had a guest that just absolutely would not accept the fact that they had to be put in a property that they didn't choose and they were not going to be satisfied unless they got everything for free. Well, my only alternative was, we're going to give you your money back, we're not going to give you keys for another property, and best of luck finding an alternate accommodation in Avalon. We tried, we couldn't quite satisfy this guest. So. There is always some solution out there. You can't always talk every guest into it, but that's our job as a property manager to be open to these situations and try and solve those problems and come up with a solution.